we're not seeing is the professional investors basically saying goodbye to the equity market or goodbye to the US equity market. They're basically saying, look, US stocks are very, very rich. Let's go overseas. Let's look at Europe. Let's look at Japan. This month, we actually saw some rotation towards emerging markets. So you're certainly seeing an equity story that really, from a positioning perspective, is one of rotation rather than a major reversal. Where did you take this survey? I'm just curious. And that's question one. But question two is, what are they doing with cash? Are they, are they deploying it, hoarding it, raising it? Well, cash is uh, one of the most watched indicators from this survey. It's a survey of about 200, 250 investors all around the world. It's got a great history, a very good track record. And basically, the survey ended since the late, the late Thursday last week. So a very, 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 very short snapshot, basically, of, of what position is. Cash is really one of the things that people watch a lot, simply because it's got a great track record in terms of market timing. When you see cash below 4%, that equals green, you want to lighten up. When you see cash above 5%, that equals clear, you want to buy. The figure last week was 4.8. It's coming down, but it's not yet at the levels that say you've got to get out of uh, the stock market. On that note, Michael, thank you so much. Great information. Thanks. Michael Hartnett with Bank of America, Merrill Lynch. Investors are watching the drama today on Capitol Hill where the House vote on health care is expected to take place tomorrow. The Republican bill faces stiff resistance from members of the Republican Party. The chair of the House Freedom Caucus says conservatives opposition to the legislation is strong after agents doubts about the legislation's future.